So somebody asked me about this uh, triumph wheel and the, about the spacers. And this is Ducati wheel and it fits to that triumph. So this is the conical spacer that fits here. And basically it is Thirty-eight inner hole, yes. And the thickness is basically based on the based on the so the axle has enough thread, so you can get this use this nut, and I have to use that washer also but this is only for this wheel so basically this this aluminium part is for this this wheel this is 20 millimeters and looks like this has sort of it fits there quite nicely so the outer race is just suitable for the this is 65 65 millimeters Probably this is the same. Yes. And what else? So the cone is basically same cone as here. So the cone. How to measure that cone with? Like it's around 10 millimeters for this part. So if the full full stack is 20, so the cone is actually 10 millimeters from. 65 to 40, maybe 44. This is actually Thirteen and five. Actually, this the inner spacer here. This is fifteen fifteen millimeters. The offset between triumph and speed triple is fifteen millimeters. I think this is exactly fifteen. I remember it. Yes. The inner hole here has no, I don't think it matters much. And I cannot remember, measure it here. But this, each hole has this kind of conical shape to fit the triumph studs. And actually this wheel has also stud holes here. So there are these kind of steel pins hammered and pin it here and they are also glued with some metal glue so actually this is very very hard to remove I can it's possible to tap it out but I never take it off it has this kind of decorative 
decorative lines just there. But it has worked very well. It, it works nice. Totally balanced it and this hasn't loosened up. This is of course very much compressed when you have 145 newton meters pushing it. So basically with this one you need also the washer, steel washer and this nut and it's pretty close that you get the same amount of thread here. The wheel is sort of here, uh, not so deep, so with Ducati wheel, you, Ducati wheel is much more like narrow here. So to get the line alignment, you need this 15 millimeters spacer here. So that's about it.